this tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to make some epic dark music. So let's get started. So first we have the piano. And the root key you want. Also add the pad to layer the node of the piano. Also add the bell in the intro. Also, you can start using some low, lower vocals like male choir for the first melody you want to add. Also, in the intro section before the break, you can add a very long sustained note on the double bass and cellos. Keep it right. For the second part of the intro section, you can start starting to add some rhythm. So for this, I use some double bass staccato notes on the, the root notes on the most lower. Some booms. The riser I showed you on, I love this riser on the other tutorial and some pulse ambient sounds to layer with your staccato notes so don't forget to add a glissando or a cluster on your build up before the big break Add some layers, also a riser. So, entering the first section, you can start by adding some ostinato, some simple ostinato. Don't go overboard on this, and give some space to newer elements to shine through. Use the lower octave, following still the root notes and the melody. You can also add some marchetto notes on the double basses and cellos to follow up your melody on the rhythm in your ostinato. section you can add some brass section such as simbassi or tubas and trombones also some french horns also in the this section until the climax start by adding percussion you can start with the lower notes. Also, in the middle point, you can start by adding some snares. Also, in this step, you can add some rhythm with your choirs. On this part of the climax, you can Keep using your rhythm in your saccato in your choirs and just start adding some melody on your sustain notes. For the effects, I still use the same boom and the new more aggressive riser. Get <coughs> so here's where things get interesting. So you get the same root note and try to follow the same melody pass with your lower staccato note. When the intensity starts growing, just keep adding new elements. And in this case, I use another instance of in the choir on the lower octave. 
So by something adding more intensity, you also gotta add new different elements to the same elements you had before. In this case, I added a faster rhythm to the ostinato. <laughs> Keep adding the choir while we do this. Also in this new part you can bu start by adding some lower brass to fill up the more lower frequencies in order to bring that dark feeling up. Also by following the intensity you should add some rips and clusters and crescendos to your higher brass section. I did this on the trumpet. And here goes the final result. Enjoy it. I'll see you in the next one.